This is a quick video to think about when we have a finite population or not. So here are my handy probabilistic props again. First, we could think about a deck of cards. We could ask the question, what percent of these cards are hearts? Now, we can answer that question if we saw every single card in the deck, and we saw that there are five hearts, and we saw that there are 20 cards, that means there's 25% hearts. And that would fully answer our question. The answer is exactly 25%. Now, in practice, we might only have a random sample of a few cards from the deck. But what makes it a finite population question is that hypothetically, if we could observe every unit in the population, we could perfectly answer our question. So you could also imagine instead of playing cards, these are individuals. Maybe the heart means uh, they're unemployed. We want to know the percentage of unemployed individuals within a particular city, or maybe uh, the cards are different individuals in your company, and hearts means that individual worked, uh, let's say, more than 40 hours a week on average in the past year. And since it's only about those specific individuals or these specific cards, that's a finite population question. In contrast, if we had the die here and we said, what's the probability that it comes up five like this? There's no finite number of roles we could take that would exactly answer our question, right? Even if we rolled it a million times, uh, we could see how many fives came up, but that would not be the answer to what's the probability of rolling a five. So in that case, we do not have a finite population. Um, in that case specifically, it would be an infinite population.